The issue here is about indoor residue spraying campaign. As is known, malaria is one of the world's deadliest killer disease. And women with pregnancies and children below the age of five are usually the vulnerable ones. No wonder, government through the Ministry of Health here in Kalulushi's Chibuluma compound are on a mission to spray houses. Over 22,000 houses in the district will undergo this exercise. This has been done to keep malaria under check. Our target is 22,000 households in Karurushi, which will cover Karurushi and Chambeshi. So that, that's the area we are, we are going to cover as a district. At the same time, you know, we want to thank our, you know, our cooperating partners, Chambeshi Metals and Chibruma Mine, for assisting us, you know, to make this event uh, successful. Not forgetting the government, you know, the government has put in a lot of money, you know, for this program, which started, you know, some four years ago, trying to eradicate, you know, malaria. You know, a mosquito, you need to kill it. If you don't kill it, it's going to kill you. So that's the purpose, you know, which we have uh, as a government, to make sure that with our health workers, you know, they are down, you know, to the ground, you know, to give services to our community. The Minister of Health has an appeal to make. We want to appeal very strongly to uh, the communities of Kalulush district, but of course not only Kalulush district, everywhere where indoor residual spring is being implemented. We want to um, remind our friends that um, IRS will only produce impact if we cover 85% of the total houses in a particular community and so this comes to our, our, ourselves to cooperate with the spray operators when they visit your homes for spraying ensure that you actually receive them and give them the necessary support that they need to ensure that they spray your houses malaria is uh, one of the leading causes of um, morbidity the leading, the leading causes of uh, mortality even in zambia and Kalush as a district and so it is very important for us as a people to ensure that we try and uh, fight this uh, disease. The exercise which started today will cover all of the Kalulushi. As for given Chiesu, his house has just been sprayed. Awe tureto tera sana kukonko kwa tumuti wa sansa mwanda kukoserisha kwa wanisu ukana alu wala munganda na umubiri pakula la ufile ule mfuika kubwini. E mkwai kutina na maluele. Others too have had their homes prayed. Our number of women to work at a kaidi to a rich shop cream, mamma mosquito, yaret smana, yaret ama malaria, ava no kurwala, so number pawe, quara to a lava fig win up. But you have been here all along. As I'm talking right now, I'm, I'm sick. I had been sick since last week, Thursday, but now I've picked up. Now, for these uh, people who have come at least to spray. Uh, the medicines. I hope maybe the situation will change. And uh, I hope if they will continue doing this, then we shall appreciate. I have been saying that they don't put enough medicine. Uh, they have been just putting water. I don't know if it's true. But now, since themselves have said that no, there is enough medicine now, they have changed their career. Let's hope that maybe the situation will change and they should be, try to see. Let them allow these people to spray and then see the effects after spray. Mshotam Pundu, ZNBC Newsline in Kalulushi.